Are you ready to take your tailgating grilling to the next level? Well, fire up those grills because today we're making brats popper boats and we're going to be using some Meat Church Honey Bacon Barbecue Rub. Got some cheese in here, a little jalapeno. Looking forward to trying these things out. You know they're going to be good. All right, let's make them. We really just start with about a cup of cream cheese. Now I'm using that already whipped cream cheese. It's already got the air in it. It's already, I mean, I don't have to bring it up to room temperature to just get it going, right? It's like that. I'm gonna put in about a cup of sharp cheddar cheese. Mix it up real good. Probably need to add a little bit more cream cheese to this. And then I have a couple tablespoons of sliced tamed jalapeno peppers and I just kind of slice these up on the side before I threw them, threw them in, mix them in there. It's going to give these a little bit of sweet, which I like. You could use any kind of sausage you want, but brats seem to be a more prevalent at tailgating. And after all, this is what it's all about, right? I'm just going to kind of flatten these out. What's really cool about these is when they get done, they actually look like a canoe more than a boat. There they are, all flattened out. Move that over a little bit, take a sharp knife. I'm just going to cut into that casing. I don't want to cut in all the way, and I don't want to go all the way on both sides. I don't want to go all the way down. I don't want to go all the way across either. And this is where a sharp knife comes in handy. Right on, that's perfect. See how they just kind of open up? Here, look at, look, it looks like a canoe, right? <laughs> Flatten these down a little bit. Open the canoe up, or the boat, because that's where our cream cheese is going in. All right, clean these up a little bit. Time to start filling our boat. You put as much of this or as little of this as you want. That's probably a little too much, but that's what I want. Do it again. I'm telling you, these are so good. And I want to thank Meat Church for giving me this idea. They did say go ahead and make it on your own. Make it your own as well. And that's the whole idea, right? You make these your own. right on check these bad boys out they look amazing before we put our brats poppers down on the smoker i want to announce a collab that's coming up and this collab is going to be way cool it starts october 6th it's going to be on my live show which is live with el Dutorino and friends friday 7 p.m and it is forever poppers and we're going to have two guests on the show myself and somebody else probably leave from smoking bears and we're going to make poppers live now it's not a competition between lee and i but for the audience it is a competition because uncle steve is sponsoring this and somebody is going to win some uncle steve shake that are in the audience stay tuned for more let's get these onto the smoker all right It is fly season, so I did. It is fly season, so I did cover them up as you saw. It is time to put them on the smoker, though. We've hit that magic 300 degrees. I'm just gonna put these down. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna put them at an angle. The reason why I'm putting them at an angle is because I want to get that real cool line that's striping on the bottom. All right, perfect. We'll see you in 30 minutes. We'll check these things out and see if they're ready to come off. We've got about five minutes before these things are done. So I'm gonna finish them off with just a little bit of Parmesan cheese. And I like the grated kind. I'm not gonna do a lot because that Parmesan can be kind of strong. Just enough, give it a little kiss. Awesome. Got five minutes is up. 
take these off. Oh, wow. Cheese is melting. Everything looks absolutely amazing. If you can see that or not, look pretty darn cool looking. I'll bring you in for a close up on these because these are definitely worth taking another look at. Seriously, they call them boats, but they look like canoes to me. Wow. I do want to sprinkle them with a little bit more of our Meat Church Honey Bacon Barbecue. Not a lot. Enough to just give it another little kiss of flavor. All right. I need to let these things cool off for a few minutes because we're going to try them separately. And we're going to try them in a bun. See you in just a moment. I want to try them with a bun. Now, the first thing we got here is I got some Hawaiian buns. You know, they got a little sweet to them. Just going to take this. We did get some those stripes on the bottom. Look at that. I'm just going to load it with whatever you want. For me, I'm going to add just a wee bit of mustard. Look at that. Yeah. Let's give it a try. Before we bite into our poppers, now I want some real jalapenos. You know me, you got to have the heat and you got to have the sweet. We're definitely going to get some sweet off of this honey bacon barbecue rub. There it is. But I'm looking for that heat. Same with here. All right. Before we do that, though, time to open a beer. It's going to help wash it down. Any heat, it's just going to add to that dimension. Mm. Woo! Holy moly. I'm telling you, you do get the heat from that jalapeno. I'm gonna try it without the jalapeno, but also get some sweet in there. I get a little bit of that cream cheese, and those two different kinds of cheeses on there. Wow. All right, let's try it without the jalapeno. Mm. You know, there's some natural heat with this broth anyways, but it is so good. These are gonna get your taste bud dancing for sure, I'm telling you. Cheese on there with that cream cheese, and even those mellowed out jalapenos that we put in there, amazing. Oh, and the bun also adds the sweetness to it because it's a Hawaiian roll, so perfect. Mmm. Holy moly. You remove that extra sweetness to it, and the meat church really shines through there. But the cheeses, the brats, cream cheese, mmm, dang good. Now, I'm going to be honest with you. I'd eat it either way. The low-carb version, carved up. Brats, popper boats. You got to try these things. Your taste buds and, and all your friends are going to thank you. And whether you're doing this at a tailgate or a home gate, these are winner, winner brats, popper boats for dinner. See you on the next episode. Thanks for watching. Mm.